What's going on guys? We're back at the Embaru engine in the test of navigation. You're able to unlock this test once you've gotten the last opaque card from Altars of Summoning. You should check out in the description below and you'll see my video on that. As you can see around the room, there's several doors and different runes. Uh, the first rune is this arc rune, so make sure you have an arc weapon equipped. Notice a symbol there. You need to match that symbol up with the other doors and it has to be on the same side so there i shot the one that was on the right side and i went through the door and i got one out of four completed next up we're going to have this solar symbol up top the letter a all you need to do again is look around the room for the solar symbol with that matching hive rune on it and shoot the door and go through it For the third one, we're gonna have the Void Rune, and that's gonna be on the left side of the door. This one's a little trickier though, because as you can see, there are actually no Void Runes on the sides of the doors. They're actually being hidden behind these symbols, like right there, there's two Solar Runes, and here in the middle, there is a Void Rune. So we'll go ahead and shoot that and go through the last door. Now this last step was very confusing. I ended up brute forcing my way through this one and just trying the different solutions. But I think what it wants you to do is stand on these ledges around the room and line up the the rune where it would be on a door. So in our case, if we were going to stand on the ledge over to the left there, the rune I'm going to shoot would line up on the left side of the door, which would make it the right door. So our runes on the left side, it's a solar rune. And then that rune would end up on the left side of the door as well. And that is how you solve the test of navigation. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any questions, leave a comment down below. Have a good one.